Hello guys, Mr. Fluffy Pants here. Today guys, another Lego review. And today guys, we got this uh, nice little exclusive poly bag, I guess, but it is uh, the Lego Shazam poly bag, which this was actually a uh, poly bag you could get with uh, one of the, you know, uh, direct to DVD, uh, uh, you know, Lego movies they do with like DC and all that. Uh, Cause this came out like back, I want to say like last May. It was like some little Shazam movie. Uh, yeah, I didn't want to spend like $25 for the Shazam movie, but this did come with it. But it's the, I believe it's the exact same minute figure that came in that one Batman set that uh, came out around 2019 around Shazam. Um, just without the hood, of course, but uh, very cool. Uh, I say it's pretty much based off the Shazam movie, though, because, I mean, look at that logo. How could it not be? Uh, and, you know, the suit's just exactly like it, honestly, but uh, it's set number 30623 Shazam, five pieces. Um, we bought it for, like, 10 bucks off him or uh, off eBay, so that's pretty good. So if you guys want to pick that up, you know, you don't have to waste your money on the movie if you don't want the movie, but let's go open this up. Um, you know, I kind of wanted a Lego Shazam, and I was like, oh, yeah, I remember they had, like, a poly bag for that or something like that. So, uh, yeah, I looked into it, and, uh, yeah, you can buy it for, like, 10 bucks. but I'm going to slice the back of the poly bag so I can keep the front just because, you know, I got, I got like, all my poly bags or whatnot from, uh, like, six, seven years ago. Okay, so I was wondering if they were going to include the little box for the cape, actually, but... Uh, that's it right there. So let's go ahead and assemble this guy. It'd be honestly really cool if his torso print could uh, glow in the dark. That'd be like awesome, but I don't think it does. It's just a little, little thought I had. So, yeah, let's go open it. Because I was, you know, like worried, like, and thank goodness they include the sockets. For some reason, recently, Lego, like, uh, like with the Star Wars set, like uh, Kylo Ren's show right there, like, you know, Kylo Ren has like the harder cape, and like I hate it because it feels like it's going to get crinkled every time I set him down. Or, like, with Mandalorian and whatnot. But uh, I love these super soft capes. And, you know, I think they're cheaper for Lego to produce, too, possibly. Actually, no, I, I think the older ones are pretty much just, like, paper. But, all uh, right, here's the Shazam minifigure. But pretty cool. I love that torso print. Uh, he's got the Thor head, uh, I believe it is. Um, no, that is not the Thor head. Never mind. But uh, it's pretty much got the same... Um, head print from that one uh Thor Ragnarok set you know with the glowy eyes but uh here on the back that's a really cool face right I love him smiling you know you got the white cape a little bit of back printing right there very cool um you know he, he could have used leg printing but honestly I don't even care like uh it's like a you know a little poly bag minifigure like uh I mean, he may could use dual model boots or whatnot, but you know what? Honestly, I don't even really care. But uh, anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think about this little poly bag down below. Uh, uh, check out my Twitter and Discord link in the description. Like and subscribe for more. Check out some of their videos, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.